out of there, this forgetful Lucy, and I'm back. Um, I'm going to go through that fog door in just a moment, but I was, uh, at the end of the last recording, I happened to notice this door right here that I, I somehow missed before. I haven't gone in it yet, but let's see. Skeptic Spice. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Um. This is a shortcut to somewhere? Maybe not a shortcut, but. Alright. Um. Pop. Okay. So, pop. What's inside? What do we got? Wilted Dusk Herb. Uh, I'm assuming that's. Like a better version of the, the Amber Herb. Yeah, Twilight Herb. Twilight. Yeah, mini. Okay, yeah. And I received a comment um, on one of my videos that apparently uh, there are secret doors that are opened by, you know, pressing the action button. Or, you know, I suppose you could call it an action button, but whatever the, the button is to, you know, do something is. And uh, that was news to me. Um, you know, I suppose. Oh, oh, okay. Bonfire aesthetic. All right. So makes me kind of uh nervous because i maybe i'm gonna have to you know good lord uh gravity uh yeah okay makes me nervous because i'm gonna have to you know go against all the walls and just keep checking them to see uh Kind of brings me back to the days when I was playing Duke Nukem 3D, you know, uh, searching for secret doors and stuff. You go, uh, 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 where is it? You know, uh, but, but I, that's just my experience with playing, you know, Duke Nukem. Um, also, woo, oh. Get... Die. Nope. Okay. Get... What do we got? Left gym. Oh, eight of them. That's cool. Um... Let's see. I want to go through there, but I have a lot of souls right now, and if that's a boss fight... Uh, I don't want to lose it, so I'm going to go level up, but I'll be right back real quick. All right. Is that a shard you found? Here, let me see it so that I may help you. Oh, that's right. I also did get an S to see shard. light, to see hope. I forgot However about that. However faint it might be. Uh, read this. Can we do it again? No. Okay. Level up. Uh, I can get four levels out of this? Okay. Well, um, I think I have enough in dexterity for now. I want to boot, keep boosting faith. Because that's uh, still going to be doing. Um, 
my weapon, it would seem. Yeah. Um. Let's uh, go for a little bit more equipment load. Because that is something that's holding me back as far as equipment. At, at least, if I'm going to be uh, sticking to this 25% uh, thing that may not actually be a thing. Uh, Alright, let's go back to, to where I was. Okay, I got back here. Uh, it wasn't pretty. Uh, I took up some hits. Um, oh gosh. It's through, through the fog door. What do we got? Oh, Sinner's Rise. Okay, that's a whole new area. Okay. Well. What the? Dudes. Using the mail breaker right now. Um, it's all right. It's 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 quicker than the 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 hide sword, the hide knight sword that I was using. Um, and I'm saving the hide knight sword for things that may be a bit more uh, dangerous uh, because weapon durability is a bit more of a big deal it would seem in Dark Souls 2 than it was in Dark Souls 1 at least that's the impression that I'm getting uh, from what's transpired so far oh and I don't want to you know have the the high night sword break at a impromptu point while I'm exploring so if I can, I want to use a perhaps uh, less useful or powerful weapon. Just, you know, so uh, I, I'm not wasting it on these peons and then be left to have to use the mail breaker against the gigantic dragon that I have to fight top of this tower. Um, I don't know that there's a dragon at the top of this tower. That's just sort of an example that I was using. Um, but if there is a dragon at the top of this tower, uh, then uh, boy, did I call it. Um, I can see there's an item all the way down there. Oh, the dude's twitching. It's weird. Okay. Um, there's an item all the way down. Oh. Dark Spirit Belt Keeper? What? I was invaded? Is. It's saying. Belt Keeper. Well. I mean, that, that name sounds like an NPC. Um, I heard it shouting. It makes me kind of nervous. Is that guy going to come up the elevator? Um, I'm not sure. I guess so.
Okay, there's no one on it. That's incredibly creepy. Uh... Oh, dear. Are they trying to get me to come down there? Oh, I see movement down there. Oh, dear. Oh, man, this is awesome. I'm having so much fun. I know I'm not really doing anything. But I'm so nervous. Oh, dear. No, 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 no. Nope, that's that's a person. That is totally a person. I'm going to heal. I don't want to die. Yeah! Banish you, invader. Get out of here. Sweet. Human effigy. Yee yee. He's trying to poison me to death. Man, that was fun. Okay. So, now I don't know whether I want to go up or down. I was going to go up when I was invaded. Um, I mean... This is probably going to terminate uh, far sooner going up, so I'm going to go up. Assuming that. Beware of Liar by Treasure Head. Oh! Hey, are you a liar? Oh, bonfire! Yay! That's cool, too. Oh, and, and just to... just to... Oh, hey! Wow, okay, those guys are very close to this bonfire. Whoa. Just to prove that I did actually learn something. Look at this. I can light a torch. Yeah. I don't know if that'll actually, um, do something. Like, if lighting that torch prevents these guys from spawning. Maybe? That'd be kind of cool. Because, well, they're in a pretty inconvenient position. Uh, it looks like there's nothing else up here. It's just a bonfire. It's a good thing I went up here first. Uh, instead of deciding to go down first. Yep. Because that uh, bonfire's gonna help me out. Oh! Sorry, sir. Oh, no. Let's see. I'm gonna heal. That man is stuck in the stairs. Oh. Another human effigy. Alright. Rolling in human effigies. this ow no don't shoot me Royal Swordsman helm Royal Swordsman gloves life gem ah cool why don't we go ahead and pop one of those um 
since I did get a little bit of uh, equipment burden, let's see, I'm at 22.2. Can I do anything? Oh, I can. Uh, I don't want to wear a hat, though. The hunter's hat is kind of sweet, though. It's pretty rad. I might just rock it for a little while. Yeah, I'm feeling the hat for now. Let's do the hat. All right, down the elevator uh, to whence the bell uh, keeper came. Do I have to? I have to pull the lever. Pull here. Yoink! And with the power editing, I'm gonna make that uh, a whole lot uh, less, you know, arduous for you. Oh, but what's going on down here? Oh. I want it. Lacerating knife. Rad. Uh. Lacerating knife. Yes. Oh. Called a throwing knife game. <laughs> uh, weakness left, then stabbing in the back. Wait, wait. Left, and then stabbing in the back. Okay. Oh dear. Um. Hello, sir. I don't know what you are, um, but you don't seem friendly. Oh, wow. He is a uh, sizable beast. Um, I'm not sure how I feel about this. He doesn't want to get on the elevator, uh, which is a kind of a bonus for me, because that gives me a little bit of area that I can move that he won't. Oh, gosh. Oh, no, he is totally on that elevator now. Okay. Oh, you can backstab him. Okay. I guess that's what it means by stepping in the back. I just didn't expect that that was a backstabable creature. Forgive me. Um, it looked like it had, you know... A shell. Sublime bone dust. Well, that is some fantastic bone dust. What does it do? Um, is that it? No. 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 Yeah, there we go. Uh, burn and bonfire to upgrade Estus flask. Burn in bonfire to upgrade Estus flask. Hold on a second. Okay, let's see. Charred ashen bones cast them for. Cast them into farfire imagula. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. 
That's fantastic. I'll be sure to do that next time I stop by a bonfire. I can just drop that in, and my S to splash will be better, which is great because they've. Uh, I've noticed that they they weren't necessarily uh, the most potent of healing devices. Um. Oh, here we go. Have at thee, sir. And I assume weakness left because... Okay. Wow. He got me pretty easily. I was... Okay, these guys are right here. Okay. I was about to say, I'm assuming weakness left means uh, you should try to roll to the left. Uh, not part of that. Let's burn some sublime bone dust. Some force has strengthened the S's blast. All right, a splash pad one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, as long as I got a bunch of these, I'm gonna go ahead and human up because I was looking a bit raggedy. Um, all right, let's go back. I see these are orange. Maybe that means that the boss has not been defeated of that area. No, because I defeated the boss of the Lost Bastille. I don't know. Anyway, let's go to... Sinners rise the salt fort. All right, now that we're back down here, Easily. Bellkeeper shield. Bellkeeper shield. What the? Killed me. Okay, I've learned my lesson, and I'm gonna send the elevator back up before I proceed. There we go. All right, that'll help in the future. All right. Now, that guy dropped a shield. Bellkeeper shield. Um, very light, requ hardly requiring any strength. Uh, but it's also not a very good shield. So, let's uh, not use that.
Okay, back up. Watch your stamina. Watch your stamina. Okay, heal up. Luckily, these guys are incredibly slow. Okay, come on. Oh, Jesus. I attracted another one. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Uh, it's times like these, I wish I had lightning bolts. Um... Yes! Success! That's pretty much exactly what I was hoping would happen. Yeah! Have at thee! I'm right here! Looks like they get a scorpion tail? I don't know. I'm pretty sure they like don't even know what kind of creature they even want to be themselves. I mean, they look like a if Frankenstein was a mermaid. Which is a strange concept. Oh, there you go. Bye bye. All right. Have having that dealt with, let's uh, continue forward. Uh, grab some of that.